Are we ready for this birthday workout? Yes, we are. How old are you again? Let's see. 79. Um, <laughs> Wait, I gotta set my timer one more time. Yes, okay. going. What did when I got to 80, I said I was going back, so I'm gonna be 71. But I we won't go through that. Yeah, your, your subtraction skills are gonna have to get real good. Well, 71. If you're going backwards. Okay. All right, so let's, let's remember here our main bounce, we call it, is a health bounce. So you're kind of in the center of your rebounder. Feet about hip width distance apart, and we're just letting the weight of our body propel us up and down. Got some momentum going. Everything's bouncing. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Take a deep breath. How about we ask you some birthday questions? Oh, no. <laughs> okay, let me have they'll, be, they'll be friendly questions. Okay. Mm -hmm. 89 years old. Okay, so you were born in 34. 34. Okay. What's been your favorite decade so far? Uh, probably the 20 to 30. When you were in your 20s and 30s? Yeah. yeah. Between that. Yeah. So that would have been like the 50s, late 50s yeah. and 60s. Yep. 55 okay. and 60s. Okay. Let's do a second move here. Let's do a little tap to the front. Tap. All right. So... 20s and 30s, what made it such a fun time? Oh, that's just when you're just starting out your married life together, you know, and uh, the kids, let's see, between 20 and 30. Yeah, the kids are there. Yeah. Little, not so big, not so mouthy. <laughs> but yeah, yeah, that, that's a good time, you know, you're used to living together, you had vacations together without kids and with kids. And yeah. Actually, what activities were you, you were golfing a lot? Golfed a lot. Dancing? Yeah. A lot? Danced, we danced a lot, yeah. Dancing and golfing, and we loved trips, road trips. Um, yeah, so we did a lot of that. Drove to California, and drove down to Florida. So, yeah, we did a lot of Okay, hey, that trips. sounds fun. All right, let's go step, tap, step, tap, step, tap. Uh, what is your favorite childhood memory? Oh, come on. <laughs> Pick one that, that sticks out, stands you out. Act, uh, younger than 15 or so. Like, before you graduated high school. Oh, one of my favorites. Or something well, memorable. My favorite thing was to be outside and to be playing with, we had 24 cats on the farm. Once. 24 cats? And most of them were in the barn, you yep. know, but, and there, there were baby kittens involved. Yeah. I remember putting them in my doll buggy uh -huh. and we wheel them out and down into the barnyard and <laughs> up to the tank. And so my love for cats maybe comes naturally. From Certainly. <laughs> yes. Uh -huh. I wasn't that, I was fond of the dogs, but you know, I didn't play with them. Yeah. Until I got Penny. Then he was my dog. He was just a tiny baby puppy. You puppy. know what story I always that sticks out that you've told me before. I can't remember what we were talking about one day and I was saying that, I was kind of complaining about being cold or something. And you made the comment, you don't know what cold is until you brush snow off the seat of the outhouse. Yeah. Yeah, so your first home did not have, did not have indoor plumbing. plumbing. No, did not. And Let's march know, front to back. I can't remember. It. Like your mom had to, um, it had a cooking stove. Yes, but carried the water in from our uh, pump was close by, but still hot doors. So, oh, she had, what did you do in the winter to pump the water? Wouldn't it freeze? Yeah, I think it must have. <laughs> you had to have gotten water somehow. Well, uh, they broke the water in the tank, but we wouldn't use the tank water. I don't, don't remember. remember. Huh. I don't know if I ever knew. Your mom must have worked so hard. She did. She had three big gardens. Well, and, and your father died when you were only one year one year old. So That's your true. mom really... Yeah, she really had her hands full. I yeah. Three, two uh, sisters and... Back and forward. <laughs> and one brother. And yeah, my dad died when I was a year old. Yeah. So mom basically raised us. They help a lot of her brothers and sisters. She had eleven of them. That's that's 
good, yeah. had people to help. Yeah. Your brother went to live with an aunt and uncle. Yes, he did. Yeah. Yeah. And that worked well because they didn't have children. And so and they had this little boy to yeah. take care of. And they did a great job with Earl. All right, let's come back to our health bounce just here in the middle. Let our momentum kind of. Did lose. you notice I was starting to puff? <laughs> <laughs> Is it feeling pretty good? Feels real good. So, in 89 years, I mean, I imagine that looking at the way kids live now versus the way you grew up probably seems so vastly different with the technology. Yeah, it is. Of course, we had the radio. So. Yeah. And I remember the spooky, squeaky door on one of the mystery shows that started with the, I can't remember the name of it, but I remember being very scared. Yeah. My sister saw to that. She mm -hmm. Oh, of course she did. For it. Yes. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, we had our favorite, you know, radio shows. Uh -huh. Do you remember when television came on the scene? Yeah, my, um, I watched it away from home because we didn't have it right away. Sure. So uh, I guess I saw my first TV. I was probably 17. 18. 17 or 18. Was that just like hard to believe, the picture on the oh, screen? Yeah, and it was a little tiny picture about like that. Uh -huh. you know? Let's march. We were at uh, my soon to be in laws watching, and they were, you know, everybody had to sit on the table. It was always not formal, but anyway, mm -hmm. uh, at the end of the table, they put the TV. Oh, of course, yes. <laughs> yeah. At the end of the dinner table, you know, so we were all crowded around the other side and watching it. Uh -huh. It was it, everybody, and then they got. TV trays. Everybody was watching TV and, yes. and eating in front of the television, uh -huh. so they had trays. So, yep, yeah, it was it was a real exciting time to yeah. watch TV. Hmm. But compared to what we have today, there was it wasn't working all that well right yeah. at first. Yeah, I think Lee first saw it in the gymnasium in mm -hmm. Johnson. Yeah. They uh, showed a football game or something, mm -hmm. and he uh, probably baseball with him. Okay, let's come to center, and we'll just do one leg, then the other. One, and the other. Good. We're already down to less than three minutes. Okay. Ten-minute workout here. I'm going to make this. Yeah. How do you use technology now? <laughs> do you use technology much I now? Use my computer. Yep. Facebook sometimes. I Facebook. I yeah. haven't as much lately, but I'll get back to it. Um, yeah, I like the games. Games, yeah. I like, uh, you always liked Tetris and some of those. <laughs> I fun. did. I Do did. you think maybe your love for like Sudoku and Tetris has helped you? Because remember, you played, you played kind of those. You've done the crossword almost oh, yeah. all, all the time. All the time. All you all always, time. and they say that it's important as you age. To do these activities. And that's something I really love yeah. doing. I just thought of that. So yeah. you have for years and years and years done the crossword, the Sudoku, mm -hmm. the Tetris where you fit the little shapes uh, together. That was the first, yeah. 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 A lot of those uh, little games track. And you know, stuff. what else is interesting is it's not like you ever really, uh, that I remember, did super hardcore workouts. You just stayed active doing fun life activities, like dancing and going golfing. We, uh, yeah, we went jogging. It was you did do some jogging? Was jogging, yeah. Yep. We lived just about a half a block, or well, I guess a block and a half, from the track. Okay. And they formed a jogging club. Okay. Did and you like jogging? Yeah. Yeah. I did a lot. Okay. Yep. So we all kept track of our miles, so we did a lot of it. Yeah. Too stay in shape and beat someone else's numbers. So what do you think about rebounding as compared to some of the other activities that you did throughout life? I think this, it seems easy to me. Mm -hmm. And uh, I never have had aches or pains from it. No, no aches or pains? No, because we're just kind of taking it easy whenever I'm doing it. But yeah. it's fun. Yeah. It, it makes you feel alive, like you said. Yes. Can't talk and do this. <laughs> We're almost at 30 seconds. You pick the final move. We haven't done any kicks, I, I don't think. Maybe we did at the beginning. Should okay. we finish up here with some kicks? 
Yep. All right. 25 seconds to okay, go. Okay, let's go. Well, the people, I think, have really been inspired by seeing you okay. do these Thank workouts. Thank you for watching and <laughs> comments. And I made her wear the tights today, by the way. And also with the gray shirt. <laughs> she said it wasn't her color. I but... never wear gray. <laughs> never. Here she came in the gray shirt. <laughs> we had to match. It's the birthday <laughs> scenery. <laughs> oh, what she wanted something to match. <laughs> oh my gosh. Happy birthday. Thank you. Mm. We'll love you. All right. Bye, everyone. Bye.